If you're looking to unlock this operator, the next part of the mission is now available. As you can see, there's now a new one available and you need to collect Hellhound Skulls. In this video, I'm going to be showing you guys the number one fastest method to get these skulls so you can get this operator as soon as it comes out. So for this, I would strongly recommend going into zombies and then you want to get yourself an Outlast contract. You want to go ahead and activate the mission and then there is something you specifically want to do in the mission to basically glitch it out and this will give you an unlimited spawn of dogs. Before I show you how to do it, if you guys are interested in any Call of Duty services, go ahead and check out Mitch Cactus in the description. They can do bot lobbies, they can get you any account unlocked with any camo, max level weapons, whatever you want on your account, they can do it for you, check them out. So you basically want to stay inside of this mission until the objective progression gets to around about 90 to 99%. Once it does this, you need to get out of the objective and then you want to open up your mini map and you need to cancel the contract. This is a glitch I've posted before and it's very good for grinding XP and camos but it works really well for this as well. So as you can see it got to about 95% I ran out, opened up my minimap and then cancelled it. This will basically glitch out the contract and now you'll have an unlimited spawn of zombies and this contract also does spawn a lot of dogs as well. Now there's two things you can do. You can either stay outside of the objective and basically wait for all of the zombies to come to you. This is a little bit easier. As you can see, there's a lot of dogs coming towards me and every single one I kill, they all drop a skull. However, like I was saying, there's two things you can do. Either stay outside, which is easier. However, there will be less dogs that spawn or if you go inside of the mission, there are a lot more zombies that spawn. So it depends how good of a player you are. Personally, I would go inside, but sometimes I did go down, so you might need a couple of self reses, etc. But it is very easy, especially if you have a pack a punched weapon, etc. Now, if it gets a little bit too hard and a little bit too chaotic, just go outside of the mission area and you can basically wait for them to come to you. This is a lot easier. But like I said, it's a lot faster and a lot more dogs do spawn if you are inside the building that the mission is in. I would also recommend having the perk PhD Flopper. I tried this first of all, but then the dogs literally just killed me because every single time you kill a dog, they leave behind fire and it kept downing me. So I went into a new game with PhD Flopper and it was much easier because every single time I killed the dog, I didn't take any damage from the fire. For this objective at the moment, you need 300 of the skulls, which is 300 dog kills, and that is really, really easy. You can get it done in one game if you do this method. Make sure to subscribe for more.